The moment a humanoid robot stands in a kitchen and prepares a complete meal with its own hands is not just a technological showcase. It is a moment that forces all of humanity to pause and ask a deeper question. Have we just crossed into an entirely new era? And TeslaBot Gen 3 is moving straight toward that milestone. Not in a laboratory. Not on a sealed industrial production line. But inside a kitchen. A space designed almost entirely for humans. Elon Musk believes Optimus Gen 3 will ignite the humanoid robot revolution, not because it is stronger or faster than other robots, but because it solves the core problems that the entire humanoid robotics industry is still stuck on. Cooking is the most unforgiving test and the one that cannot be faked. First, it's important to clarify one key point. The yellow and black Tesla bot images with the updated arms that we've seen recently are not Optimus Gen 3. Elon Musk himself has clearly confirmed that Tesla has not yet revealed Optimus V3, and those images show only version 2 and version 2.5, that versions being tele-operated for testing purposes. This distinction matters a lot, because Optimus Gen 3, according to the current plan, is set to launch in February. And this is no longer an experimental prototype. It will be the first fully finished version, polished and refined, to operate in the real world. If Optimus Gen 2 relied on tele-operation, and even suffered falls during testing. Tesla Bot Gen 3 is designed to be fully autonomous. Elon Musk states that Optimus Gen 3 can complete up to 100 open-ended tasks per day thanks to its ability to learn and imitate human behavior. He even believes the robot could cook daily and prepare breakfast, functioning like a true household assistant. This isn't emotional marketing. It's a strategic statement that reflects Tesla's long-term ambitions. So how will Tesla Bot Gen 3 overcome the cooking challenge? And why was Elon Musk genuinely amazed by his own robot? From the very first prototype known as Bumblebee to Gen 1, Gen 2, and Gen 2.5, Tesla Bot has evolved in a clearly visible way. Each version represents a leap forward not only in software, but especially in physical design. Many people tend to underestimate the importance of humanoid robot design, but in reality, Roughly 65% of a humanoid robot's performance comes from its design. If a robot is too heavy, it consumes enormous amounts of energy just to move. If it's too light, it loses stability and risks falling at any moment. And beyond that, Tesla has had to solve an even harder problem. How to make a robot that doesn't look intimidating like a Terminator is friendly enough to enter human homes and can still be mass-produced at a reasonable cost. That's why Optimus 5 2.5 was refined with softer lines, neatly enclosed joints, fewer exposed cables, and an overall appearance that feels far more like a finished commercial product than an experimental prototype. We believe the clearest picture of Optimus's true potential begins in the most familiar place of all, the kitchen. Cooking isn't just a series of repetitive mechanical actions. It's a comprehensive, real-world, and highly delicate challenge for any humanoid robot. Even a seemingly simple, Breakfast like bacon and eggs requires Optimus to open the refrigerator properly, recognize and sort ingredients, lift eggs without cracking them, turn on the stove, control a pan, crack the eggs, add oil, stir evenly, and time every single step with precision. Okay, you may not realize this, but every small action performed by the Tesla bot requires a perfect fusion of dexterous hands, sharp perception, and seamless real-time coordination. When a robot can cook, it's not just a technical achievement, it's a milestone that signals. It has crossed the line from an industrial machine to an entity capable of living and operating naturally in the human world. And this is where the difference from today's robots becomes clearer than ever. The robotic arms inside Tesla factories can weld car frames or assemble components with near-perfect speed and precision. But all of that happens in standardized, repetitive, and fully predictable environments. Put those same systems into a kitchen and they would be almost completely useless. Optimus Gen 3 can now use a frying pan, crack eggs, cook them properly, and remove them at exactly the right moment, a level of skill that feels almost unreal. To reach this capability, Elon Musk says the engineering team trained Optimus relentlessly for as long as possible. Their goal was to push the robot to a point of true mastery, where every movement is precise and errors are nearly eliminated. That effort expanded Tesla Bot Gen 3's skill set from a few hundred actions to around 3,000 tasks, nearly double that of version 2.5, which was still controversial due to its strange falls during teleoperated testing. This surge in capability is driven in part by Optimus's unique brain, 
which Elon Musk describes as a real brain, not just a conventional control system. With Gen 3, Optimus can watch cooking videos, observe how ingredients are prepped, or how a kitchen is cleaned, then run billions of simulations in a virtual environment. Through this process, it fine-tunes every movement and posture before reproducing the task naturally and smoothly in the real world. When a robot can be programmed to prepare an entire dinner, the idea of coming home after a long, exhausting day to be thoughtfully taken care of no longer feels far-fetched. Optimus doesn't just reduce the burden of household chores, it opens the door to a future where humans can focus more on what they truly want to do. As Elon Musk puts it, work becomes optional. You can do it if you want, or a robot will do it for you. In that world, money matters far less. AI and robotics continue to advance, which they are advancing very rapidly. Like I said, working will be optional, um, and people will have any goods and services that they want. This is also where most other robotics companies fail. They can build machines that walk, run, jump, even box or play table tennis. Yet those same robots can't peel an orange, wash vegetables under running water, or cook a simple meal. Cooking is the harshest integrated test for a humanoid robot. Even something as basic as eggs and a sandwich requires the robot to identify ingredients, hold eggs without breaking them, turn on the stove, control a pan, manage timing, and clean up afterward. This isn't a sequence of repetitive mechanical motions. It's the fusion of intelligence, hands, and real-time coordination. If Optimus can do this, it officially steps out of the role of an industrial robot and into the human world. Elon Musk estimates that once Optimus reaches production at a scale of around 1 million units per year, its price could stabilize between $20,000 and $25,000. That may sound expensive, but compared to the long-term cost of hiring domestic help, a personal chef, or elderly care, it could be a very reasonable investment. The AI chip alone inside Optimus is estimated to cost between $6,000 and $7,000, and each arm contains up to 26 actuators, highlighting the machine's complexity. History has already shown that Tesla turned electric vehicle batteries from a luxury technology into a mass-market one, and there's little reason to believe they can't do the same with Optimus. For Optimus Gen 3 to reach the ability to cook and successfully pass this challenge, Tesla has been working on multiple fronts at once. Alongside physical design, the company is gradually integrating XAI's Grok Voice into Optimus, allowing the robot to answer questions using spoken language. While response times are still somewhat slow and occasionally hesitant, this is a meaningful step forward. It shows that Tesla is tightly connecting robotic hardware with artificial intelligence, staying true to the philosophy it has followed for years. But for Optimus to become truly useful in everyday life, especially in the kitchen, Tesla has had to invest heavily in what matters most, the robot's brain and its hands. Elon Musk has repeatedly emphasized that humans evolved the way we did and that the entire world around us, from tools and objects to living environments, is designed for humans, especially for human hands. The human hand has more than 27 degrees of freedom, with tendons and muscles working like an intricate puppet mechanism that is both powerful and precise. Thanks to our hands, we can swing a baseball bat, thread a needle, play the piano, assemble, and disassemble a car. No other part of the human body comes close to this level of flexibility and versatility. If the goal is to create a truly general-purpose robot, the problem of the hand must be solved first. This is also where most other robotics companies fail. They can build machines that walk, run, jump, even box or play table tennis, yet those same robots can't peel an orange, wash vegetables under running water, or cook a simple meal. Cooking is the harshest integrated test for a humanoid robot. Even something as basic as eggs and a sandwich requires the robot to identify ingredients, hold eggs without breaking them, turn on the stove, control a pan, manage timing, and clean up afterward. This isn't a sequence of repetitive mechanical motions. It's the fusion of intelligence, hands, and real-time coordination. If Optimus can do this, it officially steps out of the role of an industrial robot and into the human world. Elon Musk estimates that once Optimus reaches production at a scale of around 1 million units per year, its price could stabilize between $20,000 and $25,000. That may sound expensive, but compared to the long-term cost of hiring domestic help, a personal chef, or elderly care, it could be a very reasonable investment. The AI chip alone inside Optimus is estimated to cost between $5,000 and $6,000, 
and each arm contains up to 26 actuators, highlighting the machine's complexity. History has already shown that Tesla turned electric vehicle batteries from a luxury technology into a mass market one, and there's little reason to believe they can't do the same with Optimus. What makes Optimus Gen 3 truly unsettling lies in the fusion of hardware and software? Once the hands become sufficiently dexterous, Tesla can integrate large language models, allowing users to give commands directly by voice. Optimus could even search for a cooking recipe online if it has never prepared that dish before. More importantly, as we've emphasized many times, Optimus has the ability to learn from video. By watching a YouTube tutorial or observing a human perform a task, the robot can train itself billions of times in a simulated environment, correcting mistakes and optimizing movements until it reaches near-perfect accuracy before applying the skill in the real world. Thanks to this, Optimus can learn up to 100 new tasks per day, and once one robot learns a new skill, the entire network of robots can acquire it instantly. This is the power of collective learning, something humans will never possess. Beyond cooking, Optimus being able to do laundry at home represents a similar level of complexity. Like cooking, laundry is a multi-step process that requires reasoning and judgment. The first task Optimus must handle is sorting dirty clothes. This is far from simple. The robot has to use its AI vision system to accurately identify colors, fabric types, and levels of dirt to avoid damaging clothes or causing color bleeding, a challenge that even humans sometimes get wrong. After sorting, the robot must use the extremely precise hands of the Gen 3 version to pick up clothes and load them into the washing machine, a task that requires carefully controlled grip force, not too strong to tear fabric and not too weak to drop it. Optimus can quickly learn how to operate a washing machine, after all. It can't wash clothes by hand. But the hardest part is always folding. This is a delicate task that industrial robots typically cannot handle. Optimus must recognize the type of clothing, determine the correct fold lines, and perform flattening and folding motions with precision. Its biggest advantage in overcoming this challenge is, once again, its ability to learn from video. It can watch online tutorials on how to fold a shirt and then reliably execute the process on its own. If Optimus can complete the entire laundry cycle, from sorting to neatly folding and putting clothes away, then ultimately, it means freeing families from hours of tedious household work every single week. Although Elon Musk has not yet revealed exactly how Tesla Bot will generate income for its owner, he has repeatedly emphasized that Optimus has the potential to help people become wealthier through the useful work it can perform. Think of it this way. A single Optimus could move goods, serve in restaurants, make coffee, work as a bartender, and Tesla has already demonstrated this by deploying robots in real operations at Tesla Diner. This is the clearest proof that Optimus can truly become a money-making machine. If you buy one for around $50,000, the payback period could be as short as two to three years, a figure that makes this robot a genuinely attractive investment. Elon has also reiterated his ambitious vision. Optimus could eliminate poverty and deliver great health care to everyone. To him, this represents the greatest promise of technology, not just generating profit, but improving quality of life on a global scale. Musk has pointed out that the critical building blocks needed to create Optimus have already existed within Tesla's ecosystem for many years, which is why he has absolute confidence in turning the vision of a widely accessible humanoid robot into reality. Musk insists that Optimus is not merely a technological step forward, but the greatest product in human history, with the potential to surpass even the smartphone in terms of impact. He envisions that within a few decades, everyone on Earth will want their own robot, like R2-D2 or C-3PO from Star Wars, but far smarter, more useful, and vastly more human-friendly. Tesla's robots are not limited to household chores or carrying objects. They could become assistants in operating rooms performing procedures that require a level of precision beyond the capabilities of any human surgeon. Optimus will surpass even the best surgeons, Musk said. He believes this type of robot could eliminate poverty and deliver high-quality health care to everyone. This represents Musk's boldest vision yet, technology that not only creates economic value, but also has the power to reshape the fate of the world. According to Musk, the production scale of the Tesla bot could even surpass that of electric vehicles. For Optimus Gen 5 alone, Tesla is targeting production of up to 100 million units. And Musk's confidence is not unfounded. 
Most of the core materials and components required to build Optimus already exist within Tesla's massive factories, while the remaining parts are currently being negotiated with suppliers. Musk often compares Tesla's electric vehicles to fully realized robots on four wheels. They already possess large battery packs, motors, power electronics, gearboxes, connectivity systems, vision-based AI, custom processing chips, and the ability to operate as a coordinated fleet of autonomous robots. The Cybercab, Tesla's self-driving robo-taxi, is the clearest example. From this perspective, Musk argues that Tesla is already the world's largest robot manufacturer, and that Optimus is simply a conversion from wheels to arms and legs. However, Musk also acknowledges three major technical barriers that prevent most other companies from creating truly useful humanoid robots. Building sophisticated arms and hands, developing artificial intelligence capable of understanding and operating in the real world, and most critically, achieving mass production at an enormous scale. It is precisely because Tesla has overcome all three barriers that Optimus has become a dream the company is now turning into reality. Right now, most people still need to work to earn a living and meet their basic needs. But with the explosive growth of AI and robotics, that reality may change far sooner than we expect. Optimus Gen 3 is the strongest evidence of that shift. Imagine a future where you no longer drag yourself out of bed on a Sunday morning to clean the house, cook breakfast, or rush through chores. Optimus would quietly take care of everything while you simply enjoy your day. It sounds like something straight out of sci-fi, yet... That's exactly the future Tesla Bot Gen 3 is designed to make real. A world where work is optional, and living well doesn't require constant effort just to survive. With the ability to perform over 3,000 tasks, from cooking and cleaning to assisting with caregiving, Tesla Bot Gen 3 is a genuine game-changer for busy families. Picture an Optimus helping take care of elderly relatives, monitoring vital signs, offering mobility support, assisting with personal hygiene, and providing basic health care. As modern societies struggle with rapidly aging populations and rising health care demands, a robot capable of reliable elder care could be transformative. But the influence of Optimus goes far beyond the household. In factories and industrial settings, Gen 3 could take on roles that require speed, precision, and endurance. Whether it's assembly, inspection, or material handling, the Tesla bot can step into tasks that are repetitive, physically demanding, or mentally exhausting for human workers. Musk has already stated that Tesla aims to integrate these robots deeply into its own production lines, beginning in the gigafactories, and eventually expanding outward to other industries. By doing so, Optimus Gen 3 will help raise productivity, cut labor costs, and significantly reduce the risk of workplace injuries. Jobs that are monotonous, dangerous, or highly repetitive, like operating heavy equipment or performing intricate assembly work, can be delegated to robots built specifically for such challenges. One of the most powerful advantages of Optimus in the industrial world is its ability to handle hazardous tasks that humans either cannot safely perform or should simply avoid. In short, Tesla Bot Gen 3 isn't just a household assistant, it's a blueprint for a future where humans are freed from both mundane chores and dangerous jobs, opening the door to a world where comfort, safety, and productivity are no longer limited by human labor. So, what do you think? Would you want to own a Tesla Bot Gen 3 someday? And does the idea of robots taking over human jobs worry you? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button, share it with your friends, and subscribe for more content about the future of technology. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.